the Grammy-winning singer advocated for mental health awareness throughout her life. Legendary country artist Naomi Judd died by suicide, an autopsy report released on Friday revealed, confirming multiple reports. The report, which was obtained by the Associated Press, indicated that the Love Can Build a Bridge singer died from a self-inflicted gunshot wound in her Tennessee home on April 30. The public record also noted that Judd, who had been open about her lifelong struggles with mental health, had prescription drugs in her system used to treat both post-traumatic stress disorder and bipolar disorder at the time of her death. We have always shared openly both the joys of being family. One part of our story is that our matriarch was dogged by an unfair foe, the family said in a statement to the AP. She was treated for PTSD and bipolar disorder, to which millions of Americans can relate. Mandatory credit, photo by Debbie Wong slash Shutterstock, 9710029CB, Naomi Judd CMA Music Festival, Day 4, Nashville, USA, 10 June 2018 Naomi Judd in 2018 credit, Debbie Wong slash Shutterstock Judd's youngest daughter, actor. Since then, her family has taken multiple steps to keep her death private, including filing a petition to seal death investigation transcripts and recordings, which they claim would cause significant trauma and irreparable harm, People reports. Today we sisters experienced a tragedy. We lost our beautiful mother to the disease of mental illness, the sisters said in a statement posted on Ashley's social media. We are shattered. We are navigating profound grief and know that as we loved her, she was loved by her public.